you won't believe how one of the world's smallest everyday item condom is actually made. And the process is way more intense than you think. A condom may look tiny and simple, but its creation is a full scientific process. Everything begins in Southeast Asia, where latex is tapped from rubber trees as a thick, white, sticky liquid. This raw latex is cleaned, filtered, and then shipped to factories. Inside these factories, hundreds of glass or ceramic molds are repeatedly dipped into hot liquid latex. With each dip, a new layer forms, creating the perfect thickness. The bottom edge is rolled to make the rim, the part that helps you grip and unroll it easily. Then comes the most important stage, vulcanization. The condoms are heated carefully to turn that soft latex into something strong, flexible, and safe. But the real challenge begins with quality testing. Some condoms are inflated with air until they grow as big as balloons. If even one bursts, the entire batch is rejected. Others are filled with water to check for leaks. Only the condoms that pass every single test move forward. Finally, lubrication, flavor, or texture is added. And the product is sealed inside that shiny foil wrapper you see every day. But here's the twist. What part of this process do you think is most likely to fail during testing? The air test or the water test? Think about it before you answer.